One of Brisbane's tennis legends has been honoured with a special tribute at Tennyson. Ken Fletcher died in 2006, but as Max Fortune reports, thanks to a friendship with a billionaire, Fletcher's legacy lives on. A tiny tree planted in tribute to a titan of tennis. Jeez. Ken Fletcher was the boy from Annerley who took on the world's best and in the 60s, paired with Margaret Court, Roy Emerson or John Newcomb, won every doubles title there was. That meant glamour on and off the court. He was the James Bond of the tennis world, but always worried that his mother would disapprove of his glamour boy life. Think Russell Crowe in Tennis White. <laughs> That introduced Ken to celebrities, royalty and rich men like philanthropist Chuck Feeney. What you see is what you get. Uh, no no bullshit. Uh, we had a lot of laughs together. In turn, Ken introduced Chuck to Queensland. When Chuck Feeney said he was going to give his money away, Kenny brought him to Brisbane and said, you've got to give some here. Kenny passed away six years ago. Now his old friend is giving his money away in Brisbane. The tennis larrikin from Brisbane could never have guessed he'd help so many people. In the past three years, Chuck Feeney has donated more than $100 million to Queensland Medical Research, and none of it would have happened without Ken Fletcher. There are, there are five major projects that are happening, and they wouldn't have happened if it hadn't been for, for Ken. One of those projects opens on Wednesday, a new building at Queensland's Institute of Medical Research. Well, I think it's uh, just so wonderful that uh, Ken finally gets the recognition he deserves. The tree is a tribute, the ongoing gift to medicine, a lasting legacy. Max Futcher, 10 News.